Now, the first day I got here, it was uh, very dry snow, very light snow that was falling and now it's a mixture of uh, almost icy sleet-like snow, so it's a lot heavier and uh, you can see that uh, the stuff that's lying on the ground is powdery, but uh, everywhere else, well, there's a lot of ice forming here, so it makes uh, for a more exciting and a more challenging driving surface as well. The India Bike Week, the very first one of its kind, was held in Goa. Fezan Khan was there and he has the story. It was celebration time for all bike enthusiasts and all roads led to Goa. Bikers from across the country headed in to join the ultimate bike carnival, the first ever India Bike Week. And this is where we begin our India Bike Week. This was a unique and national gathering of over 5,000 bikers and bikes organized by Fox Traveller and Harley Davidson to celebrate a love for the motorcycle, which runs through as a common vein for the participants. This also included the first ever hog ride in India, that's the Harley Owners Group. The 10 km long hog ride started from Aguada Fort till the Vagator Beach grounds and the start rally was mostly dominated by the Harleys. The bike rally ended at the Vagator beach ground and the fun was all set to begin. The venue had the best combination of bikes and of course music. of call was the vintage bike stand. Most two-wheeled beauties on display were from rare and historic brands like Triumph, Norman and Lambretta. But there was one which really caught our eye. Well, among all the super bikes and all big bikes, I'm here at the vintage bike display area. And among there are many old bikes who have almost become uh, extinct. But uh, I'm here uh, at the one of the oldest uh, model here, a Triumph Military 1938 model. And this is the oldest which I've seen among all the oldies here. The ground was alive with bikes from all segments which had the Royal Enfields, the Hondas and of course the Roaring Harleys. That's where we also came across an avid bike enthusiast from Mumbai who owns a rare 2000cc Midnight Warrior Bell Drive Yamaha and came to Bike Week to celebrate his biking passion. What brings me here is, it's just the passion of connecting with the right people head on with the passion of the people who created this event. It's great for a first initial cause and it's just good and I'm sure there will be more to come in the next year. And that's the sort of enthusiasm we saw in full measure at the India Bike Week. We learnt that distance doesn't matter but passion does and that is why bikers came into Goa from as far away as 2500 kilometers. That included some hardcore Harley Davidson owners who rode quite literally from coast to coast. And I rode to Baleswar first. From Baleswar we rode together with all our Harley brothers to uh, Rajmundri. From Rajmundri we passed on to Hyderabad and then followed on to Goa. And it's been a blast week for us. And after riding for 2,500 kilometers almost, we are feeling fine. We still want to ride. So many bikes and no stunts? Now that's not at all possible, is it?
puppies and so much more. Some real crazy stunts from these bikers. So not listen to me and watch this. After all the hard work, the bikes need care. And what's better than a bike wash from these lovely ladies? But some of us preferred the muddy look and so we skipped this one. Well, almost all the bikers have left and I'm the last one left. Before I forget my way, let me catch up. See you for that. The organizers say that the first ever two-day India Bike Week was a grand success and given the positive vibes that the organizers got this time, it means that there is definitely another opportunity for another gala gathering very soon.